Let's become SZA today. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Obviously today we're recreating SZA's iconic Afro wig, SZA-esque look thing. I personally really appreciate SZA. I love not only her music, her albums are amazing, her voice is amazing, a true talent. But I love the fact that SZA is so, like, I just love her style. Like, she's very earthy, very glam and glitz when she wants to be. I just love her vibe and her style, so of course I'm gonna want to recreate her look. I mean, I can't get this wig and not dedicate it to SZA. Come on. So that's what we're gonna be doing today is recreating Miss Sizzle's look. Um, I bought this wig off of Amazon. This wig was super cheap, like really cheap. So if you wanna purchase it, then I'm gonna link it down below. So if you want to see how we transform, then keep watching. Okay, first I'm going to quickly, very quickly do my eyebrows and I'm very excited for this part because eyebrows don't really matter with this look. The wig is so big and so poofy and so over the top that it covers my eyebrows for the most part so we ain't really gotta focus that hard on eyebrows but for the most part Sizza kind of fills them in i feel like the same as me i feel like she just follows her natural brow and then just fills in a little extra where necessary Okay, eyebrows semi kind of we're almost done right done sure okay so next is gonna be foundation and if you know anything about anything about Sezza it's that her skin is always freaking glowy no matter what she is doing what shoot she's doing whatever her skin just looks like a gloss bomb so I'm going to be using a little bit of vitamin E oil which I already do but I feel like when you use it, it makes your skin look a lot more glossier, especially up under foundation. I'm gonna use this, and I already have moisturizer on my skin, but this is just going to add that extra shine. All right, foundation time. And this Fit Me foundation from Maybelline, right? Tell me I'm right. Yep, Maybelline. And it's pretty dewy on its own as it is. Like it's definitely a dewier foundation, sure, for drugstore foundation. But that plus the vitamin E oil definitely gives us a little shine. Bring it on down and around town. Okay, cute, simple. You know, SZA doesn't cake her makeup. Okay, so I see for highlight, it looks like she kind of follows the same highlight routine that I do, which is like under the eye and down a little bit and then right here just to kind of, you know, looks like she puts a little bit up here too, so we'll try that. Okay, I probably put way too much story of my life. Story of my life! <sighs> That's way too much, but we're gonna deal with it. We're gonna roll with it. So sorry, Sizzle, I'm not doing you justice. very very little contour because Sizzle doesn't go crazy you know she's not she kind of works with her natural features I feel like little contour going A slight snatch, very slight. I feel like that's all of Sizzle's makeup. It always looks so light and airy. Like it doesn't look like she's ever like got caked on makeup. It all looks very natural and 
glowy. So it looks like she's got a little eye makeup going on. I can't tell if that's blue or black in the picture. She definitely under the eye has like a little white highlight, a little white detail. Let's try not to mess this up. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, I'm gonna use this palette. This is the Galaxy Chick. BH Cosmetics palette and we're going to be using the color Saturn. That's right, this palette is named after planets. So we're gonna be using Saturn because I feel like that's like a gold undertone-ish. So we're just gonna go right up under the eye. I don't have any false eyelashes, so I'm just gonna use some mascara. I know you're not even supposed to do that. You're not supposed to do the chick 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 chick, but I can't help it. It's ingrained into my soul at this point. I've done it for so long. Okay, next, it looks like her cheeks are kind of rosy, so I'm gonna do a little bit of like blush. Okay, next it looks like she has a little bit of lip liner. Let's see if I even have lip liner. Okay, last I'm going to spray down my face with some Mario Bettescu skincare facial spray. Just to give us that glowy look before we put our wig on. <sighs> it's riveting every time. Look how glowy. so big I have to back up my lens even more. All right guys, so this is our final look. But yeah, SZA bodied this look, so I hope I did even half the job that she did. This is such a fun look, creative, cute. Like, can I be SZA every day? Guys, this look turned out so cute. I love it and I love SZA. SZA, if you ever watch this, the odds are low that you won't ever see this, but if you do, I love you so much. But guys, that's gonna be it for this video today. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please leave a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below so we can be YouTube friends. And I'll see you guys in my next video.